Alright, alright, so. Hi. What is up? We may have a problem. I did not have much foresight in regard to this entire situation. Um, obviously a lot of you, basically almost every single video that I put up now, one or two of you ask if I am going to be doing a playthrough of Dark Souls 2. Yes. And therein lies the problem. I want to do a playthrough of Dark Souls 2. Now, I will be, obviously, I asked you guys for your uh, opinions, for your input regarding playthroughs, how long the video should be, how much I should upload per day, etc., etc., and the very, the overwhelmingly common response was about 30 minutes of video, one video a day. That's perfectly fine. I can handle that. I can do that, and I will do that. The problem... As you can see right here, I have not actually played this game for 219 hours since I started this up. I would hope I would be higher than level 38 if I had been playing this game for 219 hours. Uh, I'm right here. For those of you that may know where exactly this is, I don't want, I've been keeping it on pause because I don't want that skit to disappear. I want people to see that skit. Um, basically, I just finished Jormgen. I'm heading back through the desert on my way back to Nordopolica and all that situation uh, and whatnot. Think this is kind of like the halfway point in the game, somewhere around there. I'm not actually positive uh, how much more I have to go. The problem is, Dark Souls 2 comes out in a week. Again, I will be doing a playthrough of that game. Now, that's not a hugely inherent problem by itself, whether or not I can actually finish this game, because, like I said, I'm going to be sticking to uploading one video of the game a day. And so, right now, this would take me 40 days to upload. I have like four, I have 41 videos, I think. And so I would hope I would be able to beat Dark Souls within like probably two weeks or so, which is obviously, that's only 14 days. That's 21 days from now. That leaves us an extra, like, well actually that's 20 days from now. That would leave us an extra 20 days to finish up this game, which hopefully should not be a problem. But what I wanted to ask you is, would you prefer that I start uploading videos of this game, again, one a day, and then I would be also uploading, you know, occasional, I just did one yesterday, well, a very old one, yesterday, very old one yesterday, it's a week and a half old now, um, I would be uploading fighting game stuff in tandem, occasionally, those will not be one a day, those would be like every other day, every three days, somewhere around there, they won't be terrible, they won't be consistent, but they'll be, you know, decently, um, common. So would you prefer that I do that, and then once Dark Souls 2 comes out, I do the same thing. I will be uploading a video of Tales of Vesperia a day, a video of Dark Souls 2 a day, and then on top of that, occasional fighting game stuff. So, two or three videos a day, potentially. Or, would you prefer that I basically finish this up, save it, uh, have it off to the side and just waiting for me to start uploading wait until Dark Souls 2 comes out wait until I Beat Dark Souls 2 when I finish uploading all of Dark Souls 2 and then start uploading Tales of Vesperia So instead of that you would have a Dark Souls video every day and then occasional fighting game stuff as well So potentially either one or two videos a day Because obviously I don't want to overwhelm anybody. I do not want people to you know they just oh microphone don't fall down I don't want people to just be like ah oh, you know whatever this is too much to watch I'm gonna just not watch it I want y'all to see everything I want the microphone to stop falling down stop it oh that's why it's all fucked up um so yeah that's what I'm hoping so let me know what you think about that and now we have to now we have to get into complaint mode fucking Aver Media I want to say good things about this company I want to say everything's working perfectly. Life has been fine and dandy ever since utilizing the A for Media Live Game Report. It hasn't. Not even a little bit. RE Central has continually crashed on me, causing me to waste who knows how much time. And so basically what you are seeing here, right now, this is being recorded on Open Broadcaster Software. Because I am sick of using RE Central and I am sick of it crashing. Now here's the thing. I do not actually know 100% that it was a problem with RE Central. That that was the only problem, and utilizing a different recording software will fix all my problems. 
it may be some kind of weird compatibility issue that sometimes some switch gets flipped inside the Live Gamer Portable that causes it my computer just be like oh wait I can't understand that well now everything's fucked up now every now it's not recording anything now it, the now the programs have crashed and whatnot I'm crossing my fingers that it's just already whoever programmed Ari Central can't do it properly and it's just crashing all over the place and that's the reason open broadcaster software will fix everything I will be able to record everything perfectly fine um, but obviously again this like this isn't much of a problem in Tales of Vesperia. Because Tales of Vesperia doesn't really have like the moment to moment tension that a game like Dark Souls 2 has. Where with Dark Souls 2, you just have no idea what's around the corner. You have no idea what's awaiting you further on in the level. You don't know when you could get curb stomped by a boss or like a mini boss or anything. That's what Dark Souls 2 is. The moment to moment tension. That's why it's such like a lot of people will cite the difficulty of the game. I disagree. I mean, the difficulty is an aspect of it. The fact that you know that you could die at any point in time, that you're never really safe. That knowledge is not necessarily the difficulty, but it's that moment-to-moment -moment tension which is absent from a lot of games. That really sets... Well, basically, that's what Dark Souls is about. That's what Demon Souls is about. That's what Dark Souls is about. That moment-to-moment -moment tension where you don't know what's around the corner. You don't know what could be awaiting you further on. And so when you get to those moments, when you're, when you're fighting for your life, those are extremely exciting moments that people want to see. That's why people watch videos of Dark Souls. They want to see those moments. And so if this shit continues crashing on me, that could ruin the entire point of the playthrough. Like, I've been handling it very well it hasn't cr thank god it hasn't crashed too often but it has crashed often enough where i'm mad every time it happens but with tales of vesperia it's not a big problem i have just maintained two save files two different save files throughout the entire playthrough one that i fire up before every video and then i save on the second one after every video and then i check the video make sure all the sound is fine make sure everything worked fine if it didn't then I reload the first save file, and we go through the video again. That's not that big of a deal. I mean, yeah, you can kind of understand that I'm sitting there, you know, and I'm bored of this scene. I've already saw it. I don't want to see it again this quickly. That kind of thing happens, but it's not as big as it would be in a game like Dark Souls 2, where the exploration aspect is huge. Now, firstly, you can't even save like that in Dark Souls 2. But, even then... I could just like restart the level, like make it so every single level is one video or something like that. So, you know, like if I die and I reset, then I start the video over. I post that video and then I go for a new fresh run. That kind of thing. So that way, if the shit does crash, then I just go back to the start of the video. Then I go back to the start of the level and I redo it all. It's perfectly fine. But I could miss out on a moment like that. Like if I have gotten further than I've ever gotten before, shit crashes, you don't end up seeing it. Well, now I already know what's in front of me. Now I already know what to expect for the rest of the level. Now you just missed that moment, that surprise moment where I had to fight for my life, where I was a pixel away from dying, but I barely managed to survive. Or I died horribly. Or I died hilariously. But that moment is now gone because the game crashed, because the recording crashed and didn't get it. That's terrible. So, obviously, I am crossing my fingers hoping with all of my being that op using open broadcaster software fixes everything and that it no longer and that the uh, live game reportable no longer crashes and the recordings go uh, perfectly according to plan crossing my fingers really hoping because like I said that could ruin a playthrough just that lack of um, surprise and videos or losing really fantastic moments like that would just be absolutely terrible for a playthrough so I just wanted to let you know, let y'all know what's going on. I wanted to get that input, and I wanted to whine about Aver Media a little bit not being able to get their shit working. And the worst part, the worst part about it all, before this video, I took a sip of my hot chocolate. It took me so long to fix everything. You know, like I had to, I had to actually download Open Broadcaster software and set it all up right now because Ari sent. Did I talk about this? I don't even know if I talked about this. 
Ari Central, I did not talk about this. Ari Central had a new version, a newer version than the one I had, as well as newer firmware for the LGP. So that's why I downloaded that first to check if it worked. Uh, firstly, they didn't even have the foresight to keep the settings that you had for the program prior to, you know, whatever version, whatever new version it is. So it wiped all my settings. It killed all the profiles I had set up for the various games I'm recording. So that was cool. That was an awesome first step. And then, no fucking joke, at least it didn't waste my time, RE Central crashed within the first 10 minutes of trying to record. Because I actually, this is this is a, a reload, I'd already actually done this, I'd already gotten back to Manteic and gone through some of the events in Manteic. And then I looked over at my computer, you know, just to check and see everything's working properly. RE Central has stopped working. Excellent! Wasted time! I love it! So that was actually what prompted me to download Open Broadcaster software finally and, you know, handle all of that shit. And in that time, my hot chocolate became not hot chocolate, and I took a sip of it before I started, just so I could, you know, freshen up my throat and whatnot. Haha, <laughs> and it, it, it was gross. Not hot chocolate is gross. I don't like it. So that was the worst part of it all. Anyway, enough of that. Y'all heard enough of me bitching. Uh, I just want to let y'all let y'all know the situation and get some of your own input again because obviously again this is I'm doing this for you. I'm doing this. Well, I'm doing this for you and me. I'm hoping that I can do this and get millions of views and get millions of dollars. But not for real. He's like you're the guys that are, you were the ones that are watching. This is the footage for you. I'm not watching it. It is no skin on my back how much I upload per day. Uh, so just let me know. Would you rather, just to, to, again, summarize it up, would you prefer having a video of Tales of Vesperia alongside a video of Dark Souls 2 every single day with uh, fighting game stuff every odd day? Or would you prefer just me uploading one game uh, playthrough at a time and just put Tales of Vesperia playthrough on the back burner um, and wait until I'm done with Dark Souls 2? So let me know. And I will do whatever the most common reply is, because I don't want to like overwhelm y'all with footage and end up being like, oh, well, no, I'm just not even going to bother watching Tales of Vesperia. I'll just watch the Dark Souls one. Fuck Tales of Vesperia. And that'll make me sad, because I love Tales of Vesperia. So, let me know. Thanks.